Hey everyone, this is Relly Girl. Welcome back to Fallout 4. We are outside of Sanctuary, my medieval city. And I'm going to build a few things out here today in this episode. Um, I said I wanted to put some kind of little farmhouses over here maybe. And that's what I want to do today. I do want to put a mill in, probably over here. This looks like a good spot for a mill. And it's going to be in Castle in the Sky. There is a tab in Castle in the Sky called Manor House. And under Prefabs. If you go all the way to the back, there it is. This is what I want to use. My windmill. This thing is gigantic. I think this is the front. I'm just going to kind of place it and then pull back so we can see. Oh, it looks like I did a good job. I wanted the cobble floor to be noticeable there. And there it is. Let's make sure it's not floating around the back. Nope. Seems good. Um, what I wanted to do was have on this side... This little guy, well, big guy, I should say, this nice big windmill here. And I like the way that it's sitting because I wanted to kind of make it look like you could walk up through here to get to it. So that'll work. Also, let's go inside. I want to show you this. Look, here we're in real time now. Look at that thing, how that spins. That's just amazing. We go inside here. Look at the mechanism in here. This mod is just incredible. I absolutely love it. This is the neatest thing ever. Cobblestone floor. It looks so really, really cool. Anyway, I just can't get enough of that. I love that thing. I'm thinking on this side I want to do some farmland and put razor grain in the ground. And then over there, probably do a little farmhouse, maybe. Um, so I'm going to get back in build mode here and get out of castle in the sky because I need to find where my plot of land is. Oh, and also... Before I get to that, in resources, I have a mod that added some really cool things here. It's going to take a second to pull up. Um, right along here somewhere. And they don't always load in. I don't see it. It's not loading in right now. Well, eventually what I want to do is add some razor grain bales. Um, here in the resources tab, there's a mod that doesn't always pop up for whatever reason. If I close down and come back, it'll be there. And I can add them and put them inside that barn. So I will do that probably when I'm starting to decorate. I wanted to show you it today, but it's just not working right now. So we'll just forget about that and head over to, I believe it was CVC under resources planters. Here we go. This is what I want to put in the ground over here to make it kind of look like it's uh, tilled farm plots that we're putting the razor grain in. And there might be a couple to choose from. So there's that. Oh yeah, there's smaller single one. And then there's a really wide one. I don't think the wide one's going to fit unless I can stick it right over here somehow. Turn my surface snap off. That'll help. Maybe I could get that in. But I may just go with the skinnier one. And then they have these neat little things. But I don't think I want to do that. But look, that looks so cool and rustic. You could do that in front of a little house, maybe. I may go with these skinnier pieces so that I can kind of get them up through here a little bit. Cover that rock. Let's see. I'm going to place it and see what I think. That would work. I don't know that I want it all, all the way up against this unless I turn this a little bit more, which I can do that. Let's make it go look like you're stepping up into it from the walkway. That's what I really wanted it to do. Okay, that would probably work. Yeah. I think that'll be fine. I'm not worried about that. So if I add another one here, trying to get it all straight as much as possible so it doesn't look too silly. I want to see what this looks like. I don't think that's straight at all, but... Let's see. That's not too bad. I think my top ones are much straighter though, so I need to mess with this just a little bit. Turn these just a little. Maybe that one was pretty good. Okay. 
Well, I think that'll work. Because I'm going to put the razor grain in there. It's going to look a lot better. Um, that's a bigger one. I could have put this big guy in. Maybe I'll do that because I don't like seeing the big uh, seam down the middle there. So let's try this. Get it up here as close as I can without absolutely going into that building. Okay, I think that works. I kind of like that better. That way, and I can even turn one down here maybe. Ooh, I kind of like it like that. Turned. That way we're not going to have that big seam between the four of them. I can't tell how high it is compared to the other piece of land. Let's raise it. How's that? Is that too high? No. I think that's okay. I just don't want it to be way out here. Because I might try to lay some kind of a cobblestone road to match up with that at some point. Can I put one more here? Yeah, that'll be too big. I could try a skinnier one, but then I'll have my problem with the seams, but I'm going to try it. Let's see. Ooh, that's way too high. Come back. Okay, that's not too bad. I think I'm going to go with that. Um, this piece here, though, is bugging me. This could take me forever to do this, but... And then maybe a skinnier piece just kind of stuck in there. Oh yeah, that's good. I like that. That'll work. Now let's see. I don't know if he's got plants in here that I can use. Um, I know that I have razor grain. We could even do some corn, but probably not wild corn. Okay, I know I have some just over here. I was looking at it a little bit ago. We could do a mixture. Because that could be a grain and corn mill. Definitely. Okay, so we have... I'm trying to see where my lines are here, where I want to grow. I guess you could just put it wherever you want. Let's do a little this way, and I'm going to try to turn everybody every now and then so it's not all the same direction. Who knows if it's floating at this point. I can tell you that's not very straight. I even have different kinds of corn, like should look a little different when we plant it. Boy, that is not very straight, but hey, it doesn't have to be. Just popping it in there. Yeah, that looks cool. So what I'm going to do is fill the rest of this with corn and razor grain. And as soon as I get that done, I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. Look at that. That looks pretty cute. Nice little farm right there with nice little crops growing in here. I got rid of that statue in the background. I, I disabled a few things here. I didn't do too, too much because I don't want to crash my whole game. But, I mean, that right there looks a thousand times better than it did with the big statue in the background. So I'm happy with that. So that's going to be the little farm over there. I may add back a few bushes and things here and there to kind of fill this in later, but I'll worry about that again like I said later so right now let's get ourselves a little house or something built in here um, I'm thinking maybe this little house is gonna belong with that so maybe back here in the corner ish I'll put the house uh, what I want to do is go back to my castle in the sky Master plan, castle in the sky. Okay, 
It's going to take a second here to load back in. So I haven't been in it in a while. But um, I'm going to go ahead and put in floors. And the manor house, it has some here. Like that. They're really small, some of them. Some of them are bigger. I'm not sure. I don't think I want to do like a traditional um, house that has the rock foundation under it because I want this to kind of be more rustic out here. So I'm just going to start placing some floors and see what happens here. I like this look, the old floor look. And it's just going to be a smaller place um, because of this location. I want to put maybe a few animals out front here. I want to have enough room to stick those out too. Make it look like it's a little farmhouse. So we're going to go probably that size. I don't think I want to do a really big house over here. Now, the only thing is, is walls. I'm not sure exactly what style to do the walls in. And I also need to make sure we have a door. Here we go. Here's some doors. Which side would I want my door to be on? I like that too. I think that looks really neat. This The door on the very end. Um, or you could do it in the middle. What else do we have? Is that it as far as doors? Yeah, there's stone, but I don't want to go for stone for this. Okay. Well, I think... I'm going to go for that. I think I like that. The door kind of, sort of, in the middle. Let's do a little window on the front there. It's so cute already. Um, I don't want to do windows the whole way around it. So maybe let's do that. And... See what that looks like. Okay. We can do that. I think I'm just going to stick with this wall. And I've got a big rock face in front of us here, so it's not imperative that we have a big window there. Just something small. Okay. Now, that door leaves a little bit of a gap. Maybe I'm going to pull in one of these walls with place everywhere. There we go. That helped. There was just a gap there in the front that was bothering me. I don't want to see outside or from inside or inside from outside, whatever. Yeah, that's better. Look how nice that looks from over there. Oh, love it. Okay, I'm going to reset my lighting a little bit. It gets a little bright after a while. Okay, so we've got a cute little house here going. I don't know if I want to do a second floor. I'm probably going to leave it kind of small. Let's see if I can find um, roofs and that'll, that'll make me decide really what I want to do there. Here we got roofs. There's flat. There's a little bit of an angle. How do these go? Okay, they snap. Well, good. I also have to decide which way I want my roof to go. Whoop. Oh, okay, I see. So that would look good down here. What else do we have? Oh, wow, we have some really tall ones. How would that look? Because I could almost do like a little uh, loft in here, which might be kind of neat. Let's see. There's that. Where was the other piece that goes? Let's try that. And then this one would go right here. And this will go right here. Let's see. 
Oh, that's pretty darn cute. Okay. That would give me room to put a little loft up there for a bed. So, let's go back to... Floors. Where's my flow was? There they are. Is that the old looking floor? That's what I want. You can make a cool little loft. Or a little bed up there. Um, I kind of like that. I'm wondering if I could get a ladder in if I did it that way. I gotta think about this. If I put it that way, that would give me a little bit of room over here to kind of stick something to get up there. But I don't know really what's available to get up there. Um, what's miscellaneous? Ooh, that well right there, I'm totally gonna use that somewhere. We probably need one out here, so let's just pop one here temporarily so don't forget. That's all there is in miscellaneous. Oh, that's a cool little stable. I wonder if that would fit here too. Let's just drop that there. Furniture, vendors, animated. Those are going to be doors. Furniture I don't think is going to have a ladder, but I'm going to look. I know there's a ladder somewhere or stairs or something. I remember seeing it. I just have to figure out where it was. There's decorations. Let's see. Got all kinds of cool things here. Candles. Floor ends. Ah, here we go. That's what I was looking for. Let's see if I can get it to go. Oh, yes! And does this snap to that by chance? I just wanted to see. It goes into the floor. See how there's a little bit of, of a floating? Which I don't think that's going to hurt. Of course, you can't really climb it. But the way my roof is, I don't think anybody could physically get up there. So let's fix this a little bit. Let's take this off. Do that there. That would be better. That would give somebody room to hop up there, up the ladder. Yeah, okay. I think that'll work. We could stick a little bed, like, right there at the end. I don't know... Whoops. I don't know what kind of beds there are in this, this mod. This wasn't it. Furniture was in Manor House. Let's look at the furniture real quick. I don't want a really, really fancy bed, so I could always just use, you know, one of the regular beds from our set if they're going to be too fancy. That's not too bad, is it? Okay, let's go in here. Try to get up here so I can see. Oh yeah, look! We have room there if I didn't have the steps. But let me turn my surface snap back on. That's going to help. Maybe. It still wants to go in. Did I turn surface snapping back on? I had. Yeah. Oh, the beds snap to each other so you can make a double bed or whatever. That's neat. But this is all I really want up here is just this little guy, I think. Not quite big enough for two. You could almost scooch that in a little bit. Yeah, it's not going to work for two, so let's just move that back out where I had it. That's me. I like that. The person just has to be really careful when they're getting out of bed that they don't just kind of like walk off and fall. But that gives so much more room down here to put in our little fireplace eventually and a, a little um, chair, table place, things like that. I think that would be really cute. Yeah. Um, I would like to put some kind of a lean-to on here, or something just to kind of dress it up a little bit. So I'm going to search through this and see if there's anything that I like that I will could put on here. Like, well, we know we want a door, so if we could find just a simple door. Not a sturdy castle door, but I mean, it's not very big, so that could work. Um... It's a window. Here's a house door. I like that. Let's pop that on there. Ooh, it's not going to quite fit, is it? My door frame's just a little too big for it. Well, that's okay. 
I probably could get it to work somehow. What do these do? Do these go in these? No. Let's see what the castle door looks like. Where's it at? Where was it? This one. That fits. Let's just use that one. I wonder if I can get it to snap the other way, because I feel like the handle... Yeah, the handle's on the wrong side. Close it. Let's see if I can get it to go. Oh, did I just place another one? I did. There we go. Why is it... Let's just do that. Okay, that's a cute little door. Oh, look at that animation. That is great. Okay, I'm going to do what I said I was going to do and actually look for like a little lean-to or something that I want to put over this door here. And maybe even something over the side. We'll see. Okay, I think I know what I want to do. I love these supports. I think these are really neat looking. So what I might want to do is find that flat roof and see if I can get it to go on here. If not, I can kind of snap it myself. Oop, there's my cat. She says hello. It wants to snap inside, but I can always do that and take it off. Because I just want to see what it's going to look like. To put that there. Um, let me go in here real quick and get rid of that piece that snapped in here because I don't need it. This is all in the way here. Move it. Move it just a little bit. That I might not use here, but we'll see. That's going to be really big. Is there a smaller roof piece here? Was that as big? Let's place it. I cannot tell. Yeah, it's just as big as the other one it looks like. Okay. I was hoping there were a little bit smaller of ones. These are all the big pitchy ones. What else do we have? Is that it? Yeah. I don't think I want to use that out here. So let's just see. I like that. Let me switch that out for this other one that was looked like it had an end to it. This one. Yeah. I kind of like that. Um my wall my floor's poking out there a little bit. I could fix that, make it look like it's not. We'll do that later. Let's change this one to this one. I think if it snaps. It didn't want to snap. Why? Why are you not snapping? That one will. I think the difference is the top, isn't it? There we go. Got it. Yeah. It's the top. That's all the difference. Okay, well, I'll just go back to this one then. There we go. Okay. Um, supports. Where do these snap? They snap pretty high up on there. But there's really no other way to do it. They may look like they're floating. I want to see where I want them to go. I know I don't want that one. That could work. Okay. But they're looking like they're floating at the bottom. But. Haha. -ha, perfect. I love it. I love it. Absolutely love it. Okay. So that gives us the look of a little bit of a overhang there. I almost feel like I need a floor outside here though. I don't like how simple that looks. This is fun. It's just fun trying to figure out what you want. Let's do a little bit of a different floor out here. If I can get it to go where I want it to go and not where it wants to go. Um, let's just place it. I'll just move it myself if I need to. Okay. Place everywhere is my hero. I just want it to look like it's matched up with the side of the wall. I mean, yeah, the corner of the wall there. 
So I'm just going to move it myself since it doesn't want to snap there. It probably would uh, if I didn't have these things out already, but I like it. So I'm moving it. So I'm just moving it myself. Okay, now let's see if we can get this guy to snap. Whoop. Oh, geez, don't move my floor. We're still not quite where I wanted to be on that end. Let's see. That's doable. That's doable. Okay, that works. Well, doesn't that look cute? Okay, I have warehouse canopies in a CVC. That's what I'd kind of like to put over here on the back side. Not as far as where the little, um, little windows are, but this little piece here. So there's these end pieces, and I'm thinking I could put two of them on if I make them bigger. So this would be for the left side because of this little arm here. So I'm going to put that down, and then this would be for the right side. See how they snap so nice? But I want it to be a little bit bigger than it is. So I'm going to size that one up twice and this one up twice. Let's get this piece where I want it to go. I still need to fix that floor on the inside, but I'll do that here in a minute. All right, so this one here, totally eyeballing it. Can't see very well. Probably have to fix it a few times here, but I wanted to make it look like it's kind of one piece and stuck up under the roof as much as possible right there. How's that? It's not horrible. It's not exactly where I wanted it to go. So I want to see if Place Everywhere helps me a little bit there. Yeah. I took the seam away, I think. Let's jump down here. Bonk. Okay, it's all a little too far to the right. Now let's just move everything over here a little bit because I want it to match with the house better. I don't want it leaning too far out the back. This is going to be a little lean-to for our wood for the house inside. That's better. I like that. I think I can live with that. Yeah, so let's go in here real quick. Fix this floor a little bit because it's sticking out. And it's okay if it doesn't quite line up on the inside because you're not going to really be able to tell. I just don't want it to be outside too, too much where you could see it like that. That's a little better, but I could scooch it in just a little bit more, I think. Looking good there. I'm thinking we're fine up there. Maybe you can see it just ever so slightly, but I'm not too worried about that. Oh yeah, you can barely tell. I'm fine with that. So that's cool. That's going to be our little lean-to for the wood. I can add a few things back here, or maybe I'll put a few animals back here. So let's figure out. We need a well out here because they are away from the village. So let's figure out where this baby's going to go. Maybe like that. Um, This is a little stable but I think it's too big so I'm not going to put that there I'll use that somewhere else so that'll give me more room actually for this which is good because they need a little well maybe about right there is fine how's that look I don't know I kind of like it there but I kind of don't let's see let's try it over here The handle toward the house so they're not having to come outside too far from the house, huh? I wish it looked like water in there. I bet I could add some to make it look like it later. I think I've got some fake water somewhere that I might be able to size down enough to get in there. Maybe not. We'll see. Yeah, I think that's okay. Let's close that. Always miss the first time around. Oh yeah, I think that is cute. That's not bad for a little house. So, let's see if we can get animals in here. All the way at the end here, I've got a little mod 
or my animals farming resources. I've never used this before, so this will be kind of neat to see what we can do. Look at that, a Bramalof. So some of these animals will roam further from their houses than others. Like the little kitty cat shouldn't, or will probably walk around a lot. These guys here, I don't think you're supposed to be able to open fences or anything. This is a little chicken go block. That's cute. We've got gazelles, guard dogs. There's the bunnies I was looking for. Isn't that cute? Surface snap on so they don't go through. But what if we did a few just here and there? We'll see. They may wander off into oblivion. Let's see how far he goes. I might just end up decorating later. <laughs> Putting my animals in right before the tour. Yeah, he's... He came pretty far, but he's still technically where I wanted him to be. All right, I'm going to leave that one guy right there right now. That's going to be it. Oh, look, he's going further. Okay, he's turning around. Okay, that's all I'm going to put out just in case he disappears. I may end up having to put a little fence in with these little guys later. Oh, isn't that cute? I'm rethinking the top of my roof here. I don't know that I like it so much because of how scooped the, the roof is on the other side, so I may go with this. I kind of like that better than the flat. Um, let's take these out for right now. Where's my rabbit? He's still sitting over there. That's good. Okay. Do I have snapping on? I did not, so now I do. Let's see if it snaps anywhere. Nope, that's okay. I kind of like where it's trying to go there. Let's get it in here a little bit. This might look better. Yes. I think I might like that a little better. It's a little wonky on the side there. But I think I could probably go this way a little bit, um, to the left. How's that? Not bad. That I might like a little better. Okay, so where are sports? Let's see. Oh good, I can put them where I want. That's perfect. Because I kind of like it like this. And that this one kind of in the same place. There we go. Yeah, that's better. Now he might be able to go over just a little bit to the left. I think it was poking out, so let's move back one. I think that's going to be better. I like that much better than the flat roof because of the way my roof is scooped down there. It helps to have a little scoop right there because when you're coming up to the house, it doesn't look so flat. Yeah, I could live with that. I think that's neat. This will look really cute when it's all decorated, but this is what it's going to look like for now until I get back to uh, start decorating, and I might do that between episodes so next time I'll start and show you what it looks like all nice and decorated and then continue on with building around um, other things look at that that looks so cute too I absolutely love it oh I, I don't know what my screenshots gonna be I'm just like I love both of them okay well anyways that'll be it for today guys thanks for watching I hope that you liked this little episode if you did please give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe I'll see you guys next time bye